Now go. Whatever you do, do not crack and go hollow, lest my time spent on you be wasted. Oh, it's cloudy. Huh, I guess I got invaded by a dark wraith? Need another twenty five thousand souls, and I can get the ascended pyromancy flame. Indeed, no luck. Hmm? Well, young pupil, you must have patience, but do not keep me waiting much longer. Indeed. I have to come back and buy new spells like Great Combustion. I definitely need to be Great Combustion. But I think we should probably go Ponzor the boss. Actually, here, the 85% fire resistance from the Black Knight shield will actually be... The boss doesn't necessarily use magic. It's, uh, it's a fire boss. There's no really other way, any other way to look at it. It's a fire boss. So actually, my... Actually, my... Pyromancy is going to be pretty much, uh, useless. Will this guy actually summon in? Okay, we're going in. We're using the NPC. Fuck it. I was going to get poisoned anyway. Cut around over here to avoid fighting those guys. Walk up through the giant web covered pubic hairs. Ah. 
Uh, unfortunately, I don't think Solaire shows up for this. And these guys aren't really openly hostile, so you can just kind of ignore them. There's Maneater Mildred. You gotta watch out for with this next boss is she can do an AOE explosion centered on herself, which can kind of if it doesn't one shot you, it's pretty damn close to one shot you. Yeah, it's a flaming spider. With a sword. And tits. Chaos Witch Quilag. Spider tits. Spider tits. There's whatever a spider tits does. Got some lightning on the sword. Go to attack spider tits. Oh crap. That's the fucking AoE attack I was talking about. And Maneater Mildred is ain't doing jack shit. Because of what hand she, uh, because she's right handed, you can kind of just sneak in underneath her, underneath her right here. The thing you gotta watch out for is when she lowers her, and lowers her head down. Like that! When she does that, when she does... I'm pretty sure that... Oh. Okay, thank you, Maneater Mildred. You... As I kill the pyro, the fucking pyro queen, the pyromaniac logs in. So we got Quileg soul and stuff. And 20k in souls. 5 more K? And actually, I have 5k worth of little extra things that can just kind of pop out. that I do need to do, however. First off, let's bring this 
Ring the bell of awakening. Now that both bells have been rung. Gates to how do they call it? I guess people call it Sen's Fun House. Hey, there's like a bunch, a whole bunch of people. That down there, yeah, that's the demon ruins. Demon ruins can kiss my balls. All right. One of the reasons I farmed up all this year humanity. It's not so I can chug Estes. But where is it? Where is it? I think it's here? No. It's here, I think. Yeah. So, don't kill this guy. Oh dear. What have we here? Are you a new servant? Yes. Oh dear. But you have no eggs. Ah, no matter. Go along and have an audience with our fair lady. I pray that you will mind your manners. And this is Quilag's sister. Uh, Got what? Get out of my way. She can't really talk. If you have the old witch's ring, uh, you can actually talk to her. You can get some. She can reinforce Estes flasks. Uh, we're going to enter a covenant, though. With the. Yeah, fuck the way of the white. We get great chaos fireball! Now, this is why I gathered up all that humanity, so we can offer humanity. I need to offer, I think, 30 humanity in total, 10, then an additional 20, and I'll get another Chaos, uh, I'll get Chaos Firestorm, which isn't all exactly as useful as, you know, I want it to be. That's still pretty cool. And... Also, it will open a shortcut in an area later called Lost Isleth, which I've never been to, but I know it opens a shortcut, and we kind of need that shortcut open. So while I offer humanity to this bitch one point at a fucking time, I'm going to cut, cut the video off. So I'll see you in a couple minutes. See ya.